People often ask me, why should I register my trademark? This is Angela Langlotz. I go live here on weekdays to answer your trademark and copyright law questions. If you have questions, drop them into the comments below. I'll answer them on a future live video. So many people ask me, Angela, why should I bother to register my trademark? Well, because if you don't register your trademark, the trademark office does not know about your use of your trademark and it may allow your infringer or infringers to apply and register for their own trademark. You see, when the trademark examiners look at the trademark record to evaluate whether or not somebody already has something similar on file, they don't go out into the rest of the world to see who's using what. They limit their research to the trademark database that is at the US Patent and Trademark Office. If they don't find anything in the USPTO database that is similar to the application being applied for, the trademark being applied for, then they will issue that trademark and they will give them a trademark registration. So if you want your infringer to get a trademark registration, all you need to do is sit back and do nothing. They can get an infringing trademark registration. Well, now what? You were using it first. What do you do now that your infringer has a trademark registration? Well, you get to fight with them. <laughs> now you get to fight with them and with the trademark office who issued them the trademark registration. You get to fight with them about who has better rights to the trademark. And guess what? This sort of litigation is very expensive and very time consuming. It can take up to two years of litigation before the trademark trial and appeal board to either oppose a current trademark application or cancel an existing trademark registration. This sort of litigation is very expensive. You should plan to spend ten to $20,000 litigating this issue. And the sad thing is you could have prevented it just by registering your own trademark first. That's going to cost you, on the average, between two to $5,000, at least at the time of this video. So if you would like to prevent this sort of thing from occurring, you need to register your own trademark at the USPTO so that the trademark examiner knows about your trademark rights and can refuse any competing registrations that would infringe your trademark. I'm Angela Langlotz. I go live here on weekdays to talk trademarks and copyrights. Drop a comment into the into the <laughs> drop a comment below if you want to ask me any trademark and copyright law questions. I will answer them on a future live video and tag you so that you know I responded.